my gosh. <laughs> oh my god, it smells good. Hello there. Oh my gosh. <laughs> oh my gosh. When the doorbell rang this morning, I thought that I was getting my tripod and I was like, dope, I can record the video that was supposed to go up today. Today is Friday. Good morning. It's Friday. Um, <laughs> I haven't uploaded a video today because my tripod broke, whatever. It's a big deal. Um, I thought I was getting my tripod this morning. And lo and behold, I got something better, okay? You guys, I ran around the house with this box. I just got out of the shower in my robe, running around the house in this box, with this box, in this box, with this box. Oh my gosh. And I don't really have a tripod right now to show you properly how I'm going to undo this box, but we're gonna attempt, it's gonna, I'm trying. It's gonna be good, okay? Okay. Okay, bear with me. Here we go. Oh my God. Oh, you guys, oh, it's not gonna stay open. Yes, yes you do. Is here, is this all the stuff? Here's all this stuff that comes in it in case you wanna look. Ooh. Ooh, there's a photo challenge for an unboxing. Flat lay? I wanna be. Oh my god, you guys. Oh my god. They're each in their own little. Oh, mm, oh my god. Okay. Okay, we're taking them out. Uh, oh my god, these are big boys. These are big boys. I wasn't expecting big boys. One, okay. Two. Okay, three, 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 big boys, three big boys. Ooh, girl, what else is in there? Okay, uh, enamel pin, oh my god, so pretty. Okay, so it looks like a dragon and a falcon, possibly? Haven't read the book, have no idea. Dragon and a falcon? Let's see, let's see. Ooh, metal mark, okay. She was no victim of destiny and she would call the gods to do such terrible things. Oh my gosh, that metal mark. Oh, and it comes a little dangly. It's beautiful, red and gold royal colors. We love it. Okay, and there's a print. Okay, oh my gosh. Wow, that's pretty. Scarring? Is that scarring or shadows? I guess we'll find out later. Oh, and there it is, the uh, dragon, and is it a phoenix? Is it a hawk? We'll have no idea. We have no idea, not until we read the book. Oh my gosh, you guys. Okay, let's, now that we've seen all of the beautiful bits that there are, these are probably my favorite ones. I love a good pin. And this metal mark, I don't have a metal mark yet, so this is very exciting. Um, let's, let's open up the books. Um, I think this is the first one. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh my gosh. Is it gonna be okay? Are we gonna out okay <gasps> oh my gosh <gasps> wow wow that's done really well wow this is a thick boy oh my god how am i gonna read all of this <laughs> yay another series that's 500 pages long each She signed it. So pretty. Oh. Oh. OK, 
okay, first of all, the nakedness is amazing. Oh my god, it's amazing. First. Second, there's a whole prince on the back. Oh. oh my gosh, this is so pretty. I love this artwork. I'm so sad. This book is so beautiful. Oh my god, it smells good. Okay. Is this book two? We're just we're just gonna hope that it's book two. Oh my gosh, you guys. Oh. This one's thicker. This is a thicker boy. This is actually the last one, I think. Is it? Yeah. The Burning God is the last one, I think. Wow. More fire. More fire. We, of course, have the author signature page. Uh, let's see about the print inside. Oh, there's still prints inside. I thought we were only going to get the one. Okay. Naked book. Beautiful. Naked book. I really like that the naked covers don't have the title on it. It's just the artist rendition. Okay. Are these the same people on the other one? Am I getting spoilers by looking at this artwork right now? Probably. It's so beautiful though. It kind of... the artwork is... gorgeous. I love that they don't really have outlines. It's just like... painted? That's my style. Okay, third book. I think this is this. Jesus, I don't know. They're all so chunky. Ah. Oh, the blue, it looks so cool. It looks so cool, the blue. Oh, I wanted to let you guys know that it's only on this side. My husband thought it was on all of the sides. It's only on this side. Got you, babe. <laughs> Technically, they didn't lie. Rip off. They totes didn't lie. I love the color scheme. I've loved it. Okay, yay, we get more. Here's another naked cover. It's so beautiful. Oh my God, do all of them smell great? Yes. All of them smell great. Six hot. I'm never gonna get through these books. Oh my gosh. It's beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Hey, at least this artwork doesn't look sad. <laughs> See? They look cute. Oh. Oh. I love this art style. It's so beautiful. Absolutely gorgeous. Oh my god. Okay, we're very excited. We're very happy. I didn't get my tripod today, but that's okay. I got these books instead. And you know what? I didn't know that a Luma Crate was based in the UK. And so I thought I was going to get these much sooner. Then I realized they were in the UK. And then I was like, oh god, I'm going to have to wait forever to get them. But they're here. They're here, and I'm so happy, and they're huge and beautiful. And, 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 and look at that! Look at the fire! It's so cool! Wellington, get out of here! I'm trying to unbox. So, after some thorough reading of what the Illumicrate archives actually entails from this little uh, info sheet here, we do see that the enamel pin is a phoenix and dragon, um, that the poppy war print is foiled, here's the artist, and that it is featuring Rin with Kate and Nezha. Please, I'm sorry, I don't know how to say the names. Kate? Rin seems pretty, pretty self-explanatory. Nezha, I'm pretty sure, but Kite, I'm a little, little nervous about that one. Uh, the double-sided Poppy War metal mark 
is featuring an abbreviated version um, of a quote, and then also the artwork is of Rin and Nezha. Um, it doesn't tell me who is on the dust jackets, um, but I'm sure based on the art, I'd be able to figure it out. And also, once I read more of the book, I'll be able to uh, really know for sure what it is uh, they're showing me. So this is my uh, pin hoop up here. I put the uh, phoenix and the dragon. So they're actually two separate pieces. Um, and they create this cute little yin-yang. Um, so I put them next to each other. They're there at the top. And then here are my other pins as well. They have nothing to do with uh, books, really. Uh, we've got the sandworm from Beetlejuice, uh, Wonder Woman, Uncle Iroh from Avatar The Last Airbender. This is a legendary pin, or a dungeon pin, I'm sorry. That is from um, Loot Crate. My boyfriend at the time, now husband, bought it for me. I've got Johnny Bravo here. Man, I'm pretty. Yeah, we are. Uh, and then we've got little uh, Junimo from from Stardew Valley. I actually unboxed that in my last vlog. And then we have this sweet little heart pin, but it also has the Bi Pride flag on the inside. So that's very sweet, very cute. And then look, I just really, I mean the circles, I love how many circle things are going on on my little hoop. I just really love it. I love it and it works so well and it looks beautiful. The gold, gorgeous. You never really see this shelf. This is my tarot collection shelf. And then I also have the print of uh, Kite, Rin, and Nezha. I don't know who is who, but there's also the uh, phoenix and dragon imagery there. And then there are my tarot cards. You've never seen them before, but there they are. And then the last thing was just the metal mark. Uh, you can see it again. She was no victim of destiny and the world... The, and she would call the gods to do such terrible things. That's such a weird quote. She was no victim of destiny, and she would call the gods to do such terrible things. Hmm. I hope that uh, quote makes more sense to me once I uh, actually read more of the book. But this has, I believe... So this is Rin and Kite. So I think that's Rin and that's Kite. So then that means that... That's ooh, that's Rin, and that's Kite, and that's Nezha? Maybe? I don't know. I really have no idea. So help me? And then, of course, those books, they're right there on my shelf, just ready to be read. They're the only ones that are um, pages out, because obviously the pages are gorgeous, and it allows for a little bit of the uh, shiny to show. And on the insides, here. That's really cool. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I really loved being able to unbox and share my excitement with you all. I was super excited for this box and I'm glad we got to unbox it together. I will be doing a reading vlog for this trilogy, so that should be coming on Wednesday. But until then, have a great day, be kind, and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.